Okay, so you've embraced the Mandalorian like a Tatooine mechanic seeing the child for the first time. And now you want to know what you should queue up next. Here are three recommendations of what to watch if you love The Mandalorian, presented by USAA. Pedro Pascal, the Mando behind the mask, revealed that Mandalorian show creator Jon Favreau pointed him toward a few iconic films for character inspiration, one of which was Akira Kurosawa's Yojimbo, which you can stream right now on HBO Max. It's a Japanese film about a wandering samurai who happily accepts the bounty of the highest bidder in a battle between two rival gangs. <laughs> It takes cues from early westerns and went on to inspire Sergio Leone's Dollars trilogy with Clint Eastwood. The striking shot compositions and the morally ambiguous leading loner make this a must watch for Mandalorian fans. Obviously, we've got to give you at least one Star Wars related recommendation. If you want to know more about the intergalactic history that impacts The Mandalorian, blast over to Star Wars The Clone Wars on Disney Plus. To reach our goal, a straight path we will not follow. Over seven seasons, the series fills in the gap between Attack of the Clones and Revenge of the Sith, and Mandalorian executive producer Dave Filoni was a major creative force behind it. You'll spend quality time with crossover characters like Ahsoka Tano, you'll track the movements of a certain saber, and you'll learn more about the complicated relationship between Mandalorians and Jedi. Mandalore's violent past is behind us. It may be blasphemous to talk Star Trek in such close proximity to Star Wars, but... His enthusiasm outweighs his discretion. Exactly. We can't help but recommend Star Trek Discovery on CBS All Access. Are you really that crazy? Good to know. The show begins roughly 10 years before the events of the original series, in the midst of a war between the Klingon and the Federation. Discovery is one of the darker Star Trek entries, likely to resonate with fans of Deep Space Nine. The series tackles multiculturalism on a galactic scale, and continues to move the franchise boldly into the future, with a cast that is diverse in gender, race, and sexuality. I'm responsible for forging my own path. We all are. Okay, we hope you can enjoy these shows and movies before you inevitably go back and rewatch all of The Mandalorian. A man of your skill should make short work of this.